I'm Dave Roseberry with Matthew 25. And uh, many of you know that this is a ministry of the Anglican Church in North America that's just getting started. We've had some applicants uh, last year that applied for funds, and when they were granted, they did some amazing things. Uh, just a couple of weeks ago, I was in the Diocese of Pittsburgh, and I sat down with a, uh, with a few of them, and I said, uh, tell me about the ministry that you um, are involved with. And uh, boy, the creation, the, the creativity, the passion. Uh, you're going to hear a couple of them talk about uh, what God has done through their church in their community. So listen to Herb Miller of Uncommon Grounds Cafe and Nancy McComb of Christ the Redeemer Anglican Parish. Herb Miller is with the church army and has created eff effectively um, a, a coffee house and um, Nancy is helping to run this amazing, and you've, you've got to say, very needed diaper pantry out of their parish. Uh, great stories. Um, listen to what they have to say. Okay, Herbert Bailey. I'm an officer, officer with Church Army USA, and uh, I'm the executive ministry director of Uncommon Grounds Cafe, which is a ministry uh, that's been recognized by the ACNA. The cafe, in a word, is a place of sanctuary. It is a place where we get to offer hospitality. Our, our call is to anything that's going to help facilitate relationships. We want to move people from, walk with people from isolation to community. And so we look for opportunities to do that. We really are supported from uh, the local communities. A huge part of that is uh, us going out and, and connecting with uh, the different parishes and churches uh, to let them know that we're available. Our call is to simply bring people into the life ministry of the church, and it's, uh, we see the church's responsibility to do the discipling. And so we are supported by probably 50 different uh, churches, as well as uh, individuals who give of their time, talent, and, and uh, treasure. My name is Nancy Kane McComb. I am a deacon and parish administrator at Redeemer Parish in Cannonsburg in the Diocese of Pittsburgh. I don't think that any of us were aware that the diapers for single moms and people with low income are not covered uh, by food stamps or any other program that they can have. This is a real burden. You cannot send your child to daycare without diapers. And it, it just became uh, so apparent that a lot of times these mothers were having to skip work because they didn't have diapers and so it became like a cycle. This gives them an opportunity then to get them over that hump and give them those diapers that they need. What has happened as a result of the starting of the diaper pantry, we have people working in the diaper pantry from five years old all the way to I think our oldest is 94. And it's just been, um, it's been a, a way for our parish to come together and work for something that is just so tremendous. You see what I'm talking about. It's an amazing ministry. And we are in the process of making Matthew 25 a household name in the Anglican Church in North America. You can go to matthew25i.org and uh, take a look around, but also if your parish or your ministry is, is looking for a way of reaching the community in the spirit of what Jesus said in Matthew 25, then download the application, start a process of prayer, talk to the leadership in your church and certainly your bishop, and um, I hope that you will uh, take advantage of this amazing opportunity. Thanks so much for watching.